so for today's video I'm gonna teach you how to transfer money from Metrobank online app to your Gcash app so first of all you just have to have your Metrobank app which is this one so you just have to input your username And then your password and then log in okay so once uh, you are logged in to your Gcash so uh, this so it will show your account and your available balance okay so just like this one okay so now, if you want to transfer from your Metrobank account to your Gcash, you just have to click this burger button, this one. Okay. And then, transfer to other bank. Okay. So now, you just have to choose either Instapay or PesoNet. So... Either of the two is okay. So let me use Instapay. Okay. So, so now you can see non-Metro Bank account and then one-time transfer. So you just have to use one-time transfer. Click transfer. Okay. So now... So now ito yung makikita nyo after nyo i-click yung transfer. So, so now you just have to choose Gcash. So bank, then please select this one. So you just have to find Gcash. Okay. Okay, so this one. Okay. Next is you just have to input your account number. So, so as you can see there are red asterisks. It means that those should be filled up. Okay, so account number. So for example, the account number is 0998265-7045, for example. And then this one, beneficiary, so you just have to click individual. So first name, so for example, um, first name is Mary Joy. And then, last name is Cabriana. So, since walang asterisk yung, yung middle name, so, so you can skip that one. So, the address, you can also skip that one. Then, the purpose, so for example, you can put payment. Okay, so depende sa inyo. And then, email address. So, it's necessary that you should put your email address. Kasi doon, isi-send yung receipt or yung confirmation na na-transfer na yung money. Okay? So, just click next. So, just ignore this one. Yung save this beneficiary. Just proceed to next. Okay? So, now, you just have to click this one. Kasi ito yung gagamitin natin or ito yung pagkukuha na natin. So, please select the source account for your funds transfer okay and then you just have to click this one then you just have to input the amount that you will transfer so for example we will transfer 500 pesos so take note there will be 25 peso fee per transaction so ang madididak sa account is 525 since 500 yung ito transfer natin na money. So just click next. And then you can put message to recipient or remarks, but you can also skip that one. So for example, we'll put transfer done. Okay. And then submit. Okay, so now, you have to enter the one-time password that is sent to your mobile na naka-register sa inyong Metrobank app. So, you just have to wait 
po the one-time password na mara-receive sa inyong mobile via SMS. So, if you didn't receive the one-time password, you can click resend this one para mag-resend ito ng one-time password. So, the one-time password is 593592. So, every transaction, iba-iba yung one-time password. Okay? So, depende kung ano yung marireceive nyo na one-time password. So, just click submit. So, processing, please wait. So, when you transfer using this Metrobank app, of course, you need to have an internet connection. Okay? So, transaction is in process. This one. So, transaction is in process. And then, of course, you have to screenshot this as a proof. Okay? So, since uh, yung GCash app ko yung transferan ko from Metrobank to my GCash account, so, magno-notify sa akin na na-receive ko, na may na-receive ako na 500 peso from Metrobank. So, just like this one, you have received 500 pesos of GCash from Metropolitan Bank and Trust Co. Corporation with account ending 9663. Your new balance is 500. Okay, so let's check if meron na bang naman yung GCash app natin. Okay, so as you can see, meron na tayong 500 pesos na available balance. So that's it. Thank you.